aim of curbing illicit drugs from entering Nigeria, the men of the Nigerian Drug Law Enforcement Agency arrested four drug traffickers coming in from Brazil at the E-Wing Aramba of the Bunitala International Airport. These arrests made on the 27th of January by the National Drug Law Enforcement Agency remained the largest single seizure in Nigeria in 15 years. One of the suspects who trafficked 26.850 kilograms of cocaine, estimated at 30 billion naira, denied any knowledge of the substance in a baggage. I don't even know the quantity that the quantity of the blanket that he gave me because I, I took Uber to Airport Street and um, I bought that. Getting to to Nigeria, uh, the NDL, NDLEA, they, they controlled me. And um, that's how I come to know the, the things that are inside when I was in their main office, you know. Another suspect said he was paid 4,000 euros to swallow heroin from Italy to Nigeria. Honest with you, uh, I, I, I don't really have much idea about the, the gravity of the of the offense and the whole thing because I really don't know much about, about it. it. It's just my first time and if for, for my entire life, I have not, I have not, I don't even know, I don't even have idea of different drugs and I have not seen it. I, I the commander NDLA here in Lagos said, with a new chief executive officer, the agency is ready to stop the inflow of illicit drugs into the country. The air transport to come in with uh, that quantity of, uh, of, um, of drug, not through cargo but as uh, checked in luggage is, is huge. So that is, uh, that is um, I think the arrest, I think in the last 10 years is the single individual arrest made by a passenger uh, through the airport. With this, it is evident that the fight against drugs requires effective policy from government while constantly educating the populace on the dangers of illicit drugs. Ademola Lawrence, TVC News, Lagos.